very strong Arctic cold front, which is ushering in cold air to the entire eastern half of the country. Dangerous cold impacts millions across the U.S. Frightening moments as a plane slides off an icy runway in Chicago. There was no visibility at all. Jimmy Carter back in the hospital to have a procedure to relieve pressure in his brain caused by bleeding from a series of recent falls. Gaza militants have fired dozens of rockets into Israel after the death of an Islamic Jihad leader in an Israeli airstrike. In California, 14 fraternities suspended following a student's death. Hours earlier, the young man was at a fraternity event. The U.S. Supreme Court will hear arguments about the Trump administration wanting to end DACA. Their decision could affect roughly 700,000 people. Can you imagine a life outside the U.S.? 737 Max Jets could be back in the sky pretty soon. Boeing says deliveries of those planes could resume next month. Mexico's top security official says arrests have been made for last week's cartel murders of nine American women and children. All that. An off duty police officer catches a lot of attention at an Arkansas club. The problem is naked. And all that matters. Billionaire Michael Bloomberg is considering a run for the White House. I, I have my reservations about it. crime was out of control. Instead of complaining about the cops, he was like, Alfred, build me a car that shoots grenades. I'll do this myself. I'll just do it myself. On CBS this week. Game of the year. The undefeated 49ers hosting the Seahawks at Levi's. Came down to kicks in overtime. San Fran missed there. Seattle did not. And Seattle has done it in a classic. And San Francisco suffers their first loss.